Now, for most things in the Google world, as a super admin, I can pretty much do whatever I want. If I've got an employee and I wanna read their emails, I can just reset the password in their account and I can log in. Suppose I'm added to a share drive, I'm the manager. Apart from that, there's no other members added, it's only me. Now, if I upload files, will anyone have access to the files or be able to see them? Can the organization or someone above me get access to these if I'm removed from accessing it? There's no other members them, uh, apart from me in the shared drive. The short answer to this is, is yes. If you've got a shared drive, it lives underneath a company, right? It lives underneath a Google Workspace account. So any shared drive is gonna be accessible by the super administrator of that Google Workspace account. So even if they're not a member right now, they can add themselves as a member. And this is what it looks like. So you're here in your admin panel. So admin.google.com. I am gonna open up my shared drive settings. Here we go. Okay, so inside the settings, for Drive and Docs, so Apps, Google Workspace, Drive and Docs, we've got Manage Shared Drives. And here as a super administrator, what I can do is I can choose any one of my shared drives. I can open up, here we go, someone's created a test. I can go Manage Members, and if I want, I can add myself or anybody else. That's the wrong email address, but you get the idea. Um, so I can add anybody willy-nilly to this shared drive if I wish, and that means effectively as a super administrator, I've got full control of this. Now, for most things in the Google world, as a super admin, I can pretty much do whatever I want. If I've got an employee and I wanna read their emails, I can just reset the password in their account and I can log in. If I wanna see what chat messages someone's sending to someone else in a direct message, which you know many people think are private, I can log into Google Vault, which stores a copy of every message from every account. And even if someone has deleted a message after sending it, I can still find that inside Google Vault. So effectively a super administrator is that. They've got access to absolutely everything within an account. So um, if you're an employee or someone else who is part of an account, then expect that anything inside Google Workspace is accessible by the administrators. If you liked this video, we've got plenty more on the channel covering this topic and much, much more.